I think you know, from from our perspective, there there's a couple of couple of key things. Um, we're uh, we have, uh, in fact, we just crossed the 400,000 customer mark, uh, and so we have a, a very broad base of customers across all different segments. And so, um, and so, one of the key areas that we're we're doing, which I would say is not really a trend, but uh, drilling down much deeper into segmentation. Uh, you know, across our markets, uh, not only from a geo perspective, but but from you know customer size, and we're trying to go a little bit more up market uh, and implement more you know account based marketing um, uh, type type things on on the the higher end of the market. Uh, so that that's key. Uh, and then the other the other key for us is just that community that I talked about. We're going to be launching very soon here some some augmentation uh, to the community that we built. We have a an amazing forum. Uh, for our customers to exchange ideas and uh, and give us feedback on our products and our product management team is like you know very deep into that and and they spend a good portion of their day on those forums interacting with customers and getting ideas and things of that sort but we're going to be building out that community relative to to training user groups um, you know uh, giving the community opportunities to create blogs and and podcasts and things of that sort, and then do some gamification around that. Uh, so again, not not necessarily, I would say on the you know, there's many companies that do that, but but I think our foundation again is is very different, uh, and our net promoter score is extremely high. We're at like 75 uh, for customer satisfaction, so that's a really key focus from a company perspective. Uh, so you know, again, just I think I think the the bringing it all together. Uh, and into a cohesive strategy and getting alignments uh, is uh, is something that's like absolutely critical for us at, at this time at Beam.